Hello friends and welcome back to Alien Protocols. So across the world in many different megalithic structures, you see walls like this that have this exquisite craftsmanship where these stones don't even require cement. They are shaped and fitted so wonderfully well that the walls take on this almost magical kind of appearance where you see walls built at a later period where they didn't take the time and the effort to make such incredible walls. And all this extra time and effort are the very things that make them more resistant to earthquakes. But someone today asked me to find out what these little nubs are for. And so I did a viewing and basically the nubs are for little wood uh, levers and poles to be used to help lift the stones and they use a powder on the stones. Um, sometimes a red and a white powder, a red ochre and a white. And when they drop the stone back down and lift it back up, they can see where it's still um, not perfect. And so they're oftentimes done over and over again. And they can be, and they're popped up like this kind of thing. But, um, and you can tell when you really look at pictures of it that the bottoms are flat and uh, very much better placement for um, support beams underneath. But they also used levers. They would use a stone and a long rod and another piece of wood here on the nubs to lift them up in the air. They also use a sand and a polishing stone and several other methods um, to make this really perfect. And um, this is not magic. It's not aliens. It's not laser beams. They didn't melt the stones. It's just good old fashioned human ingenuity, tenacity and hard work. And um, usually when they're done, they would um, remove them by just hammering them away and, and destroying them. But oftentimes they would leave some as climbing points to help build other parts of the wall or give builders some foot leverage to build uh, other layers. So um, that's the deal with these little nubs. It was a neat journey to discover this and um, I really enjoyed this viewing. Much love to you and yours.